we show up at this this place you can't even see it it's fully dark but you know it's you know your trip up there was really exposed the way the roads are here um, and every time they tell us we're staying in a tent or a mud hut I'm always thinking like oh man this is gonna be interesting but all of a sudden there's this you know proper building up there that's really you know well made and rooms are nice and so we get there and we go to bed we don't really know what to expect when we wake up but when we wake up in the morning it's just like go up the stairs out of your room onto this rooftop set up with uh, you know breakfast and everything and the view is insane Deserto e sabbia intorno a me Just moving everyone with the bike straight on, even the camera guys just hit the bikes to have like the beautiful ride down into the valley. And um, yeah, just, just arrive in, the, in that first section, really rocky and try to scope for good places and saw that amazing, really tight single track uh, down to a village with like probably the tightest switchback I ever saw. We ended up dropping into this canyon, ended up down in a little rocky section, that's right, we're halfway down the gully and uh, we're scoping out a couple of little rocky drops when uh, one of the local shepherds is bringing his, his flock up. He comes over to say hello and we're all shaking him by the hand and he's such a friendly dude. Um, but he's looking at the bikes and he's looking at us and then he looks at the trail we're pointed at and he goes, well, go on then, I wanna see you ride this rocky shit. You know, he's like saying, well, go on then. He's like encouraging us as if he thinks he's gonna see some carnage. carried on then working our way down into the uh, the next village where all these kids just came out um, flocked around us and uh, probably took the piss a little bit I think but um, with the language barrier we had no idea and yeah we carried on down the hill we met the trucks but we, we then spotted a, a bit of single track that um, traversed the hill in front of us um, and with the Sun going down we thought we better go and uh, try and make the most of it 
so we um we hiked up rather rapidly uh and then just hit it as fast as we could i was following mark and uh it was impossible to see it was complete guesswork with the dust and the rocks flying up you couldn't see a thing Just went full speed, all four of us, just wide open down, get to the trucks, and uh, just realize how lucky we are to have a day like that. 